If you are a voting delegate, you should have received an email like this. If you are having issues finding this email, look for the email vote at simplyvoting.com. It may also end up in your junk or spam folder. If you still do not find this email, please contact jp at dataonthespot.com. Before the start of the meeting, write down your elector ID and password on a piece of paper for your reference. To participate in the meeting, join via web if you are using a laptop or desktop and Chrome as your web browser. For the all-in-one integrated solution, click here. Enter your name and click on the join via web button or press enter. At this point, you will be let into the meeting. During discussion, if you would like to speak to a motion, click on the participants tab and raise your hand. This will enter you into the speaker's queue. You will be prompted when it is your turn to speak. When it is time to vote, you will need to refer to the credentials email to find your elector ID and password. Click on the secure voting button at the top of the page to get to the voting frame. Here you will enter in your elector ID and your password. Click login. Once logged in, you may automatically be opened into a ballot. Here, again, you will make your selection, click continue, change your answer if you need to, continue, and make sure to confirm, then you will see success. If you wish to review the vote you just submitted, scroll down to the voting receipt section. Here you will see how you voted. Click on next vote to return to the home page. Again, as a reminder, before conducting any voting, click on the Next Vote button. This will refresh the page and reveal any current ballot. When you are done voting, return to the live stream by clicking here. Or just simply scroll up. If you have any issues scrolling around the page, make sure to use the scroll bars on the side or the links at the top of the page. Please note that the voting section is also scrollable, so it has its own separate scrolling feature. If you are trying to scroll up and down the main page, but are in, within this voting frame, you may not be able to as easily. So you will need to move your mouse out of the voting frame or use the scroll bar on the side.